What's going on, Juan? This is Daniel from Josh and Any SEO. We're going to take a quick look at your website, see what's going on, and see what we can do. So right off the bat, we have Amigos Painting. Great. If you have a logo, definitely get it up there. If this is the logo, perfect. Uh, if not, um, I mean, make it. Uh, you, you can go to Canva, get a free subscription, create yourself a really cool uh, a logo, put it behind over here. Um, get a quote, call now, get direction. So those three are great. Unfortunately, over here, this is a little outdated. Plus, there's no services. We need your services and typically have them here. The hamburger menu is outdated. Amigos Painting, get quote, excellent painting, painter in Cedar Hill. So you're pretty clear about that. Updates, we're missing. Um, that's a bit ago. And then testimonials. No real testimonies, which is why it's not really you know necessary to have them on your website because, you know, some are good, some are not good uh, to have there, especially if there's no real content, content. And then you have all these pictures, which are great, but in reference to what? What are the services that you're offering? And then it's a contact, which is fine. Um, and then call now, get direction. So overall, uh, it's fine. Um, no content in here whatsoever. Google's very strict about that one. They want about 1,500 to 2,000 words of content on your website alone. Now, it, again, it is powered by Google, so you are going to get a good outstanding backend ranking, but it's useless if you don't have anything in here. So um, let's talk about that a little bit. A UR rating is when your website link is somewhere uh, is strong. You have a 15, and then a DR rating is a trust that Google has in you now. Because it's a Google product, the website you're using, that's why they have a trust in you. Unfortunately, there's nothing on there for you to get anywhere. Like you have no backlinks, uh, which is when you have your website link somewhere else that somebody can click on, and you have no referring domains, which is when if they click on it, it comes back to you, and you have no keywords, which is what this is. Keyword is what somebody will put into Google to find out who you are or to find a service they're looking for. So Painters Nashville, Tennessee is a keyword, but even more than that, it's a buyer intent keyword because they're looking specifically for a painter in Nashville, Tennessee. Now, I know you're you're close to, you said you're in Cedar Hill over there. Um, I'm going with Nashville because most people in the smaller areas like Smyrna, Murfreesboro, um, you know, like a lot of those areas, they're going to reference Nashville instead. But, you know, you over here, you have an ad paid for. So if you do them correctly, you can, you know, get some good results from it. Could be costly if you do incorrectly. Again, more ad uh, to get you into the GMB, Google My Business Profile. Very important to get in here because uh, 30 to 40 percent of all people will click on one of these three guys. Um, and then we find out we have our organic search. Now, this is where uh, anyone can rank as long as you're doing things correctly. First thing we have is we have Yelp. And then finally, we have the first organic search, which is going to be your biggest com uh, competitor, Nashville Design House Painters. I wonder if that's what I got. I did not. I bounced like went to the house painters. My bad. But Nashville House Painters. Um, services they have a drop down menu about us drop locations they have multiple locations all of these are mostly right in the area so i don't know if there's any point they're missing murfreesboro there's probably nothing in there anyway pricing um i typically you know i don't know about pricing you know so i'm not gonna say much and then they have their stuff here is click to call click to get started um so very good they talk about create your own personalized atmosphere and space uh, keep your home protected personalize it to your style and then they finally talk about what it is they do so kitchen cabinet painting refresh your kitchen so they talk a little bit about it i would talk a lot more instead of just like as little as they did meet them which is the about us flawless painting services so they talk again a little bit about what they do and then portfolio so again, it's just showing the customer that they're the ones to go with because they're so, uh, they have, but there's very little on what it is they actually do, which is a problem because Google wants um, content, like I said earlier, and a lot of it has to do with what's on the back end. So because I went, I didn't pick the right person here. Let's put them in over here. Let's see if I can quickly get through Nashville House Painters. Uh oh, it's asking me to log in. Interesting. So I'm actually going to X out of this. But we're going to talk a little bit about keywords, and we're going to talk a little bit about uh, why they are so important. And let's see if I can get Nashville Design. So let's see what they're doing on the back end to stay ahead of the game and you know stay on top. So right off the bat, we're going to go to Overview, not Overview 2.0. We will see that they have a UR rating. Oops, did not mean to do that. As soon as it loads, of course, of 21. So Google really does like their website. Um, they also have a DR rating of seven. So Google does trust them a lot because they have 590 backlinks and then 74 do return to them. Now, not all backlinks are created equal ones. Some are more spammy than others. So be careful which ones you do choose. But then they also have 408 organic keywords while, while pulling in almost 800 people a month to their website. So let's find out what those organic keywords are. Now, we're going to pay attention to the keyword over here. 
the volume that people are searching for per month, the traffic they're going to get per month, and then the position they're in. So I put in Painters Nashville, 450 people a month are searching for it. He's getting almost 70 a month, 69, and he's in position number three for that. Now take House Painters, for example. It sounds like a great thing to search for, but it's not because it's not location specific. So anyone in the United States out of these 11,000 people can find it. Yeah, he's getting 200 people to his website because of it, but he's they could be anywhere. They can be in, you know, Texas. So really not good to go for them. A lot of this is good one house exterior uh, painters in Nashville, 250. He's getting 47 because he's in position two. So as you can see, it's very important that you have your uh, what you are and your location in it so that you can get the traffic as well as, you know, um, uh, as well as the position with the volume that comes with it. So how does this help you out one? All we got to do is find backlinks, right? We got to get good backlinks in here, which means all you got to do is go over to Nashville House Painter, use their backlinks uh, that are really working well. And, um, you know, that's one of the ways to just outrank your competitor right then and there. But the second thing is content. We need content on your pages. We got to make sure that on the front page alone, home page is uh, at least 1,500 to 2,000 words of painting with relevant content. Can't just be anything. You got to have relevant content that makes sense. And then third is organic keywords. Stuff that people are searching for, house painters in Nashville, house painters in Cedar Hill, stuff like that. So that when people put that in Google, you're ranking for it. Well, anyway, that's all I got. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out. Other than that, I got nothing. You have a great day. Bye.